Hello and welcome everyone. Welcome to the stream. How's it going? Long have we waited. Greetings, friend. How are y'all doing? Welcome, welcome to the Warcraft 3 Reforged launch stream. It's the 28th of January, except of course, if you are from Australia, New Zealand, uh, Asia, or even Moscow, Russia. In 50 minutes from now, one of the most iconic games of our times Greetings, friend. is getting released with the Reforged, and I'm looking forward to it very much so. And I, we're going to take a little bit of a trip down to the last 18 years and look at some of the uh, Warcraft content Greetings, friend. over the past times. And then we'll finally make it to the present and Reforged release. <laughs> Thanks for the subs, guys. Long have we waited, now we are debated, question mark, Codexus, Aclanac, 28 January, 28 months, Warcraft realized, and I must go to sleep, have fun Grubby today, thanks man. Greetings, friend. Alright. So, Warcraft 3 Reforged will be playable via your Batonet launcher. Whether or not you have purchased Greetings, Reforged, friend. you will be playing that client, the one via the launcher. If you own Reign of Chaos or Frozen Throne in your Battle.net account, you can also play Warcraft uh, 3. Uh, but you won't be using friend. the Warcraft Reforged graphic settings. So let's... Uh, yeah, let's go through the patch notes uh, for today. We have uh, the patch notes right here. This is uh, yeah, this is today's reforged patch notes release. Greetings, friend. The campaign will actually have several new missions. There are some known issues as well. There, uh, they they actually found five new missions that were not part of the uh, original campaign before, supposedly. They reworked through three of the maps uh, to look differently. They also released this cool uh, article on the Bassinet site. I'll link it in the chat now. Three missions that were lost, yeah. Isn't that cool? I usually don't find things I lost, but they did. They're not new, but Greetings, they were lost. Friend. Uh, they released an article here about uh, RTS. I'll add it to the uh, to the bot. Excavation mark RTS. Greetings, if you don't know what an RTS is. Make more stuff and try not to die. Oh. <laughs> How do I climb the ladder? So this is pretty cool. You can check this out if you're curious about the controls and everything. Uh, today we are going to be playing the campaign as soon as it comes out. Every time we win a campaign mission, we're going to be giving away one copy of Warcraft 3 Reforged afterwards in a random raffle to any follower that follows the stream. Greetings, friend. We actually found this pretty cool thing, uh, was posted on Reddit as well. The Warcraft 3 announcement in 1999. Greetings, there was a very different vision for the game back then. Let's check it out. Looks a lot like World of Warcraft, right? Opponent, how you want to build your, your parties and which heroes you want to use. 
I feel old because I remember this. <laughs> The argument for every MOBA and MMORPG. Thanks for committing to a 48 hour stream, Grub. <laughs> oh, CD! Brilliant. Als die Bombe einschlug. Eine neue Zeit, Alter. After laboring in secrecy. Oh, thanks. Thanks, Bjorn. Neue Findung der Echtzeit. Cool stuff. This is a, a GameSpot preview. Let's suppose that you're writing a real... From way back when. On Sunday at this year's ECTS in London, Blizzard Entertainment announced Warcraft 3 the sequel to the four-year-old Warcraft 2. Those who are expecting an evolutionary sequel will be surprised. For what we saw indicated a revolutionary game that would transform the Warcraft franchise into a 3D universe and a new type of strategy game. Target release date 2000, by the way. Omega lol. <laughs> we now know it came out in 2002. Rob Pardo, producer and senior designer on Warcraft 3, emphasized that Warcraft 3 will not be a real-time strategy game. He called it a role-playing strategy game. Resource management, that's what attracted me to the game initially. Resource management, huge armies and base building are being scaled back in favor of questing, <laughs> hero recruitment and interactive environments. Rather than leading huge armies around the map, you'll be commanding heroes and smaller squads of units. Although some might worry that Blizzard has abandoned the strategy genre to create a role-playing game, that is not the case. Many role-playing elements have been added, but this is still, at its core, a strategy game. The most notable new feature are the six races instead of two, a more integrated story and environment, the 3D engine and of course the addition of many role-playing elements. In Warcraft 3, you can play six races, not just the orcs and humans of its predecessors, but also new evils that have descended on the land of Azeroth that make the squabble between orcs and humans look like little more than a schoolyard scrap. Extra dimensional demons called the Burning Legion, the fiery creatures who were the driving force behind the orcs of the previous games, have fallen from the sky. Ancient prophecies. They have now manifested in the world of Warcraft 3. <laughs> Unironic. And they should be monstrous, powerful and thoroughly evil. The one demon unit we saw in Infernal was a hulking brute that was perpetually on fire. Blizzard would not comment on the other three races, but our guess is that at least one could be undead. But they did say there would be many neutral units, unattached to any particular race. Although there will be six races, Blizzard did not commit to six campaigns, <laughs> saying only that you will play all six in the campaigns. 
<laughs> so good. Yo, thank you guys for the subs. Struts here. Naji, Milia, Melania, Anithor, Riot, Get Rich Brothers, Gosu Kill, Instamitier, Steak Hutsi, uh, Benis X, Ulf the Wolf, Lizling, Tyrosan, uh, Puya, Mac, Thorin, Arcavius, Sithesis, Parallel GG, Dr. Clyde, Axiomas, and more. Reforged is around the corner, guys. 40 minutes. Warcraft Reforged is a stunning reimagining of the revolutionary real-time strategy game that laid the foundation for Azeroth's most epic stories. It is a remake in its truest sense, featuring a thorough visual overhaul, a suite of contemporary Greetings, social and matchmaking features, and more. Command the Night Elves, Undeads, Orcs and Humans as alliances shift and armies clash in this timeless real-time strategy game. Greetings, friend. That's a, the Spoils of War edition. And here are the system requirements. Screenshot it if you like. And quickly update your Greetings, computer, you've still got 39 friend. minutes. Did you know if Spoils of War Edition will be available after launch? Greetings, friend. I would imagine so. I'm, I mean, I'm, I'm not sure, but I would imagine so. Is a Titan X enough? Uh, I think you might want to double SLI it. You want to SLI that. It's uh, 38 minutes till the game comes out, yeah. Any idea what is happening with Classic with this new patch? Well, Karaplavator, I would imagine that you can no longer play Classic with the new patch. Uh, but if you own Classic, you can play it via Reforce in the old graphic settings, but you won't have the separate clients anymore so you can still play it essentially an avalanche of work goes into reforge even a single warcraft 3 model and i think they had like 2200 so i got this cool uh night elf article you can play in the campaign already in offline mode but the game cannot be played yet. Right, let me restart my Batonite launcher. Well, there's no crossplay because you can't crossplay between one game. You'll have one game that can have both settings. So it's like, it's like Y play. Sorry about that. Greetings, friend. Greetings, friend. You can't start the game yet, so no campaign. <laughs> There's an important question. Can we play the Illidan Arthas cinematic right away? No, we have to wait till we get there. Greetings, friend. Not bad on that launcher, just start from your old icon. Ah, we'll just wait till release. Hey, what's up, uh, Berna, 3 Ezo, Headzona, K, Shayer, Ruin, Terror of War, Energy HD. Thanks, guys. Demonantes are dark, shadowy warriors who are shunned by the greater Night Elf society. Kind of like Dark Templar. They wield demonically charged warblades in battle, call upon fell energies to augment their formidable combat skills, and they now have a chance to appear in either male or female variations during multiplayer matches. Which one is female? Scenarius. Taronda. The one on the left? Greetings, friend. Arthas Menethil. <laughs> Those eyebrows, man. Look at the old Arthas. 
Those eyebrows look wicked. <laughs> Stupid sexy Arthas. <laughs> I love his chin. I like the long face, long chin thing, you know? Long hair. I have a question, Grub. If I have Warcraft 3 Classic, but I never bought Reforged, can I still play Classic online? Yes. If not, that's real messed up, because I basically lose money now. Yes, you have lost $30 over the last 18 years. It's about $1 and 30 cents per year. But yes, you would have lost uh, money and only gained thousands of hours of enjoyment. In my case, tens of thousands. But yes, you can still play Classic via the Bazanet launcher. It's true, I also did not yet account for inflation. You can use your legacy CD key to play Reforged in SD. Yes, absolutely. That's good. I friended him, Arc Arctic. Greetings, friend. The undead. I sent you an interesting link on Discord. Let me see. Greetings, oh, cool. Friend. A post from 2000. Oh, that's very white. Is that the wrong link, do nine? <laughs> Trolled? Greetings, oh, don't send me white links. <laughs> Sometimes I'm watching a stream on my mobile phone and streamer suddenly opens a white page and I'm like, ah, blue light. Now I can't sleep for two hours. Greetings, friend. Dark dark mode websites only, please. Mikoto the Red King, W3 Rome, Basilisk, Saiken, and Vador Vef. Thank you guys. Thank you very much for the sub. Thanks for joining the launch party. With vampiric rune blades and shadowy steeds, Death Knights serve as the scourge's mightiest generals. Old Arthas. Old Arthur's Death Knight, new one. There was no dark mode in 2002, I guess so. I can't wait to play with this one. Well, against. So today's stream, I think, will be at least 10 hours, if not more. Someone asked, will you be completing the whole campaign today? If I recall correctly, the whole campaign, ROC, anti-FT, plus bonus missions, takes more than 50 hours. I think back when I must have taken hundreds of hours on it, because I played really slow. Uh, no, I will not be doing a three-day non-stop stream. I'm trying to ration myself for the rest of the year as well. The original Dota mod already works in Reforged. I played it a few weeks ago in the beta. I can't play the game now, says uh, Gutit. Yes, that's because all servers are down for Classic and for Reforged Beta, because the beta is over, uh, and will be released in 31 uh, minutes. No three day, but four days. You'll find that four includes three. Scary, hairy spooters. I don't know if item hotkeys are possible yet in Reforged. Even post-release of Reforged today, additional features will continue to be streaming in.
Uh, I just wanted to uh, highlight something important for everyone. Let me see. Uh, you can now do 100,000 cute points, there's channel points, cute point redemptions, 100,000 points to uh, highlight your awesomeness. Uh, Segal wanted everyone to know that he is in fact so, so well spent. If you're looking for a good uh, place to spend your points on. <laughs> Isn't Segal awesome guys? I need 60k more. <laughs> That's alright, Rinzea. Feels okay, man. Comment from 2002. It seems like a bad ripoff of Warlord's Battlecry 2. <laughs> Kek W. What is the best beginner race? The one you enjoy the most. As a beginner, you're not that good anyway. So how about focusing on, on pleasure rather than winning? I also wanted to check out this uh, throwback video. Today I'm celebrating with you not just the not just the Reforge release, but also the uh, everything that came before, including some of the tournament games that I played in Warcraft Three. So it's been a long time since I watched this with you guys. So let's check it out. Warning, low quality. <laughs> Cries in 360 pixels. Yeah, that's true, Shining Force. Everything is at stake for Grubby. Moon can still lose one map. He's leading 1 0 in this grand finals. Moon won so much. He's never been able to win a WCG yet. We have to check that both players are ready. Too fast. Now the game is starting. Moon versus Grubby, Korea versus the Netherlands. Beautiful, the Night Elf player, Moon starting in the bottom left. Building his Ancient of War outside of his base. Trying to throw the angry Night Elves back. Very comfortably winning the first map, getting that GG. Building the Altar of Elders. That's happy, by the way. Beastmaster Fire Lord in the first game. Ah, no, Beastmaster Fire Lord hot in the semi finals versus me. We don't want to speculate too much what's going to happen now. First scout peon on the way. You don't have to translate, I understand this. Alright, Raushovic, I'll stop. 
werden wir hier gerade in den Whisk nochmal sehen, der hier schön gefährt. Kann es sich natürlich auch nicht leisten, das Producing Building zu verlieren. Immer wieder so ein kleiner Kampf, auch wenn der Gegner sich raufstürzen sollte, wäre das extrem fatal, wenn der hier down geht. Heißt, hier nochmal kurz frisst ein paar Bäume. Aber inzwischen ist auch schon der Hero da und damit wird es ja auch... Uh, in the meantime, the Hero arrives as well. He won't be losing his Insta4 to Creeps. Gloves of Haste. Meanwhile, the Blade Master reached the Goblin Shop and sold his town portal and got a circlet of nobility to push his stats. Now the Blade Master going for the creep that holds the item. Another circlet of nobility. He would have maybe preferred to have a Claws of Attack, but it's still good. The Demon Hunter is now already coming over this way. He's too late, the Wind Walk already happening. The Blady, without a problem, is able to pull back. Man, they should update these graphics. Have we got news for you, Stomp and Romper? <laughs> Warcraft 3 recasted. Now the Blade Master is going to be attempting to find another item. Let's see if Moon will try to steal the experience here with the Archer. And the Blade Master now receives uh, Gloves of Haste. Yeah, it's Kaldor and his uh, co-caster, Orkish, I believe. No, not Orkish. Oh, beautiful dust of appearance! Nice prediction. Reaper. Kaldor and Reaper. He would like to do a block there with the Wisp, beautiful. Surround! How cool is that then? Now he has to use the potion of invulnerability. Beautiful blocks. Sensational! I hear the call of the wilds. Beastmaster, second hero. Torrent Chieftain, second hero on the side of the Orc player. Two Ancient of Wind on the side of Moon. Here at 9 o'clock, Moon clearing his expansion. The Blade Master is already here. The shop is blocking the base, preventing access. But it does not have good armor. He has to be careful with that shop. The shop will go down. A Grubby now exercising pressure on Timon. The Demon Hunter is getting surrounded. A second one. Moon has the town portal. Grubby gains that town portal out of him. And again! He has to be careful! Another one! 
He has to get out of there. Two hit points! This cannot be happening. <laughs> Sensational. Sensational. What was that then? That would have been unbelievable. But nice save. Now the Blade Master has to be careful once again. Pulling back now, Moon. Healing self once again on the Blade Master. Constantly putting pressure and snare upgrade finishing now. Tinker is being created. The Goblin Tinker with the big nose. And snare on the wisp, it will be detonating. Why is the game censored? No, this is 2008. Re uploaded a few times. Crazy thing we're seeing here right now. Crazy close to. The first game already very, very good. This is crazy. The Beastmaster now getting level 2 with the Boots of Speed as well. Slippers of Agility on the Demon Hunter. Forty-three food now on the side of Grubby. I'm glad they're saying it, I can't see it. Grubby wants to translate this early game advantage into a bigger one. Das Glück des Tüchtigen. Fortune favors the bold. The Night Elf is creeping. Found another Slippers of Agility. Greetings, friend. He secures himself the shop here. Found a Tome of Agility. And Snare goes on the Hawk. He's luring the Ogrelord. There comes Moon. The Night Elf. He has to be careful. He gets himself the creep anyway. The Shockwave. The Cyclone on the Blade Master, the TC is not yet level 3. Now he gets it, level up for the TC! Potion of Invulnerability used on the Blade Master. Grubby's got to be careful, the mana burn comes out. Constantly the cyclone on the main hero. Going on those talents. Smacking them on the nose. This boy is trying his best. In the meantime, the game is playable. Shall we start? Reforge is playable. Or do we finish the video? <laughs> Greetings, friend. I've heard it's playable, but the game cannot be played yet, I see. We have to finish this. We'll just wait till midnight. Someone trolled me. <laughs> this always happens. It's okay, we can wait another few minutes. 
danach der dann nutzen, um sich an den Moonlands erneut zu heilen. Wenn wir jetzt hier noch mal kurz das Creeping sehen, drei Power hier noch. Zwei der Beastmasters, also noch nicht die Quirbys auf zwei. Spawn Battle Power hier noch auf Level 1 und auch der Tinker natürlich nicht mit Level 3 am Start. Denn jetzt der Org erneut, erneut kommt. Er will angreifen, er will rein. Aber er zieht die Borg vielleicht wie erwartet ab. Er will hier nicht in die Reichweite. Und er geht stattdessen jetzt erstmal wieder Wave rein. Trifft der schön was Und jetzt auf der Demon Hunter. Geist auf Bord, er findet da. No Dump Order for the Demon. Da muss er jetzt aufpassen. Da kommt der Critical. Critical! The Demon Hunter goes down. No staff. <laughs> what a stupid idea. Every level 20 player knows this. No staff. Grubby is doing a cool, cool fight, cool game. The Demon Hunter is making a good job. The triple hero of the Night Elf is going after these units. And yet he will now go to heal at the Fountain of Health. And yet, and now. <laughs> That fight was so important. He's got himself that unholy aura, now devotion aura as well. Go go R E F O R T G E D is online. <laughs> Thank you, Alex. I know, but we're almost done with this. They're early. <laughs> Detours. Yeah, I restarted Battle.net, I know. <laughs> Blizzard being early, it's nice. Uh, what map is this? Secret Valley. If Orc runs around without what? It's suicide? Speed scroll? Why didn't Moon veto Secret Valley against the Orc? It was another map. Echo? I think he removed Echo. I really think Echo is better for me. Yeah, I like Secret Valley, I miss it. Oh, if you run away from an orc, it's suicide. Because of an snare. Very nice fairy dragon armor, blocking the damage. He goes on the Tinker! Shockwave and it goes down! Oh baby, what a wave! 
gesehen, was dieser Area of Effects Spell in so einer Nacht LF Nani anrichten kann. Und deswegen taucht auch immer wieder die Potion of Mana und er wird sich hinge, wird natürlich sofort revived, der dritte Held von Night of Player. Ja, jetzt ist der Spot zu viel wieder hochgelaufen, ist weg, aber der Ork Player sieht das natürlich und kommt natürlich jetzt von hinten. Er wird natürlich immer wieder versuchen, irgendwelche Units rauszuschneiden. Der Blade Master wird jetzt erstmal in die Lüfte bewegt durch das Cyclone eben und äh, die, äh, der Night Elf zieht sich natürlich zurück. Er wird hier nicht gegen zwei. The Night Elf will pull back. He doesn't want to fight here with two heroes. He will buy another scroll of healing here. <laughs> How many points away are you? Another name by Sitas. Und wir haben gerade gesehen, es gibt noch eine Scroll of Feelings für den Orc Player und die Post of Invulnerability wurde. There's one more heal scroll here for the Orc Player. Also da muss man wirklich aufpassen jetzt. Er hat natürlich jetzt. No Invul, he's got to be very careful. Es gibt zwei Shops immerhin, aber die meisten Items hat jetzt jeder Night Elf Player für sich entscheiden. There are two shops here, but Night Elf purchased most of the current inventory already. Tolles, tolles Spiel, was wir hier sehen. Der Moonstone eingesetzt, Blabby hier nochmal am Start mit seiner Armee, der Raider und Spirit Walker Mix, wie wir ihn kennen. Der Level 4 Blade Master am Start, er scoutet erneut, er scoutet erneut. He's scouting once again. He's starting with his long distance mining now, the Orc. He wants to get that TC at level 5. Privet, Cake. It gets tighter and scarier for Moon. That's going to be the level 5. Potion of Mana as well on the TC? I don't think so. With the opponent being Moon, you have to use everything you can. Moon will never want to give up and concede defeat. And he's got the capabilities. This will not be an easy route for him. Traitor. The Beastmaster is level 3 and that could be a very decisive component. The next fight. Of course Moon wants to stand in the safety of his own base. He wants to use his Moon Wells, his Ancients, his shop. Grubby is getting closer. He sees what's going on. Why is he watching in German? Because passion and emotion transcends language. And I'm translating it for you. This is the best cast of that time. Grubby doesn't trust himself to go into this base here. Grubby now starting an expansion at the 3 o'clock position. The Great Hall still has to be defended, of course. It's been scouted now. He'll be sending his horde back soon. 
Und jetzt Scrubby nochmal links oben, ja, heilt sich hier nochmal. Und inzwischen weiß man, was Sache ist. Die Main Gold Mines, sie sind leer. Main Gold Mines have just emptied. Und jetzt wird sofort, sofort der Tree of Eternity erlootet. And immediately the Tree of Eternity will uproot. And Moon has to assault this expansion. Wow, I thought Reforged graphics would be better. This is not Reforged yet. We will play that in... 8 minutes. The Tinker goes, goes down! Moon tried to send his Tinker level 2 to get an item. Grubby found him and utilizes the chance. Tinker being remade. Will be cycloning the blade immediately. He goes on the altar. He doesn't want the Tinker to be able to come back. The altar is down. He is destroying the main base here. Moon needs to come back and defend. Too late to save most of it. You think, why would I run back, right? There's a Tinker dead. Well, this is a scary army. Where's the shockwave? It's not coming out. He's running onto the but he's running onto the beastmaster now. In a bloodlust. Potion of invulnerability. Potion of invulnerability goes down. Going on that second hero over and over again. Giving over the staff. But the Beastmaster goes down. But Grubby loses so much. Let's go. Grub hype laughing face. Thirty-eight supply for Moon. Greetings, friend. Still so many talents. He, he loses another Walker and pulls back. He has to cancel his expansion. The only mining orc has is this long distance mining. Moon is mining now, this cannot possibly be true. What, what will Grubby do now? The orc will have to use his heroes to try and pull this game towards himself. He cannot yet revive the Tinker. Greetings, friend. The Blade Master is so close to level 6. The ultimate Blade Storm can be so strong. I can't explain why the Tinker is back unless he built an altar. You don't need altar, by the way, for revive. But it's okay. And he staffed the Tinker. In the main base is Grubby once again. Greetings, friend. Grubby needs mana, he needs those shock waves. Shockwave, pretty good. Finding a good place. Also 
This is Reforged with Ray Tracing. No, Reforged in three minutes. Again, such a nice move with the Fairy Dragons, using the Fairy Dragons armor. A little bit of a base trade here by Grubby. Moon sacrifices one unit. Thank you for the subs, guys. Over and over, these ensnares are coming down here. Shockwave now, but nice scroll of healing. The Beastmaster goes down. Disenchant over and over. He's taking too much damage with the Raiders. Critical strike. Where's the crit? The Demon Hunter goes down. Double level six. The ensnare on the Tinker must be coming out here. Critical! This has to be it! Grabby on fire! Demon and Beast coming back! He's buying everything. He goes out on the mine. The wisps, of course, are going to be detonating. Cut to this 2008 crap. <laughs> Don't be salty because 2008 is beautiful. Video is done in a minute. This has to be it! He has to die! Crazy! One one. Now let's watch the tiebreaker. We never paid any heed to the ancient prophecies. <laughs> Like fools, we clung to the old hatreds. Sorry, I, I tapped. And fought as we had for generations. I tapped, I tapped. I had to lower the volume. Until 
made the sky rain fire, and the new enemy came among us. destruction for the reign of chaos has come at last reforge We are in, boys. Warcraft Reforged is live. Let's see. Let's put some nice resolution. Spiro the Kid, thanks for the sub, dude. Put everything high. I usually turn the rain off. I'll keep it on. I'll keep it on for now. Maximum scroll speed, reduce mouse lag, classic key bindings. So here's, if you own a classic key, this is where you switch. Oh, well, this is where you can't switch. <laughs> if you have reforged, use the reforged settings. Enhanced tooltips, yes. Show numbers for cooldowns. Yeah, let's show the new setting. Formation, movement, toggle, best to turn it off. Uh, anyone here doesn't like violence? Eh. Save replays. Profanity filter. Enhanced violence. I don't see the setting. Team colored life bars, no. Damaged. Use the pog. Uther Pog. Hey, thanks. Delarock. Thanks for the subs. Green Machine, Der Alcevain, Jora, and Poma Moba. And everyone else, thank you so much. We're also going to link our account. Safe settings first. I'm curious how this works. I wonder if I can link more than one. But let's say if I cannot. Then I better make it good. Thank you for being a part of the Warcraft 3 community. We couldn't have done any of this without you. Let's see if I can do another. Would I want to? I'll think about it later. Alright, can we check our profile now? Not yet. Ah, replay is migrated. Nice. Ah, we can start farming icons in the multiplayer. Menu is a lot smoother.
Yeah, I don't see the TFT icons yet. Let's, let's get things going. I just want to take a quick look at the multiplayer. Same look as the beta. And they have uh, FFA, 4v4, 1v1, 2v2, 3v3. The map pool that we already saw. That'll be fun later as well. But let's begin on the campaign. The prologue campaign. Exodus of the Horde. Scourge. And then Locked. This looks nice. Story mode. You have little or no experience playing strategy games. Normal. You have some experience playing strategy games. Or hard. Greetings, friend. Let's go. I have some experience. The sands of time have run out. Son of Duratan. The cries of war echo upon the winds. You sure you can handle hard? It's only my second playthrough of the campaign. The remnants of the past scar the land. Once again, by conflict. Five K hours in Warcraft. Try thirty K. Thanks, Nelson Laufer. Have a good one. You too, Kappa Kappa Reno. Svenius, over at Meyer. <laughs> what an idiot. <laughs> he fell. Heroes arise to challenge fate and lead their brethren to battle. <laughs> Lost before the fight even began. As mortal armies rush blindly towards their doom. The burning shadow comes to consume us all. Yo, what's up with those clouds? Rally the horde and lead your people to their destiny. Me? Seek me out. Seek me out, and then he flies away. <laughs> Such a tease. Somewhere in the Arathi Highlands, Thrall, the young warchief of the Orcish Horde, wakes from his troubling dream. I just lost. Greetings, friend. <laughs> Let's try again. <laughs> I can do better. We can always lower the difficulty. Uh, 
Uh, well, let's try normal. <laughs> I thought I could do better than that. <laughs> uh, maybe it's my... Is it like my virus program or something? Restart, then it works. Okay. Have you tried restarting it? Yes. Uh, but I asked you Good 10 seconds ago. Spread. I've already restarted it. Oh, your computer wasn't on. Yeah. Always start by restarting it first. Select difficulty. Hard. It feels good. It feels different now. There we go. Just restart. What kind of nightmare was that? I don't know. Where do I put myself? I don't know what to do with myself. It was not a nightmare, young war chief, but a vision. Follow me, and I will reveal what your future holds. I don't know what this is all about, but I'll play along. I just have to move for the... Oh, thanks. Thanks for giving me Farsight to begin with. Excellent. You seem eager to be on your way. However, you must first learn how to give orders to Thrall. Try ordering Thrall. Isn't this hard? No cooldown, by the way. Skillful. Very good. The path to the next banner leads. Notice how the black area shrinks as Thrall moves through it. <laughs> this reflects areas you have explored. Lotar, my warriors. I did set it to hard. are yours to command, war chief. Prepare yourselves. I sense a noble ahead. To order Thrall's forces to defeat this Valkyrie, no select all of your troops. No, this was only a scout. But the Knoll's camp lies just ahead. Oh, no. <laughs> There's three Knolls. to perform an aggressive attack move into the enemy encampment. To do this, select all of your troops. Click the attack button and then left click on the ground in the middle of the null camp. I'm kind of relishing how well we're doing so far. The spirits are restless. I've played some single player campaigns Let's recently get on with it. that were a lot harder. War Chief, we've discovered a group of Murloc raiders in the nearby river. The Murlocs would make excellent targets for your new chain lightning. This style. narrator is so Perhaps not fantasy. Uses a new ability. Click on the chain lightning button and then I am some monsters. Can you handle Murlocs though? <laughs> treasure chests hold powerful you can do magic this. items that can oh, only thanks, be picked man. up by heroes such as Thrall. Spirits are restless. Hey, the orcs look super cool. The war chief. The spirits Still forgetting are items. <laughs> this particular treasure chest contained a useful potion of mana. Notice that the potion now occupies one of Thrall's inventory slots I near the bottom middle the of your screen. Chief. Potions of mana can be used to Let's replenish your hero's mana. The magic energy that allow the casting no of spells such as chain lightning. For honor. For doom hammer. <laughs> yes. Correct. <laughs> For honor. The wolf howl signifies that night has begun. Be wary, my 